What's up, guys? It's Knasty3090 here, and yes, we are back for more trade day. Now, before I get going, I have a link in the description below. Um, <coughs> so last night I was streaming, and I pulled Honors Eli Manning. So if you want to see the live reaction to that, I will have a clip to a very condensed, it's like a four-minute video of my rea live reaction to pulling that Eli Manning. Unfortunately, due to copyright reasons, I could not put it on YouTube. I did clip it down to a short little video, and the link will be right in the description below. So, and also, if you are have not already followed me on Twitch, we were doing like a little bit of a live trade day last night. I got some new cards that we're going to be putting on the trade block tonight, and here they are, guys. Here are the cards. We have a uh, nine new ones. Eric Reed, I think I had last time. I think we bought him, but hey, I'm maybe moving. People seem to like that card. Now, um, real quick. If you look at here, you're going to see one card here that I would say I would never get rid of, but people were begging for me to put this card on the trade block last night, so I had I had to do it. So, it's this Olivier Vernon. So, here are the cards, guys. All of them are up for, they're going to expire between around 8.15 to 8.20 Eastern Standard Time on Wednesday, February 8th. Um, so, just keep that in mind. The team wanted for these is the Chicago Bears, like usual. Um, I'll show you guys how to search that real quick, and I'm going to tell you guys what positions I'm looking for. Or maybe even type of chemistry is what I'm looking for. I feel like that's going to be a big thing this time is fitting chemistries for certain players. Because there are certain players on my team that I really want that um that I, I know the player that I want. And I know the chemistries that match them. And I can tell you guys that. And that will actually help me pick an offer tomorrow. I'm going to really focus on chemistry. As long as the value is there. Like if it's within 10%, I'll get all that in a second too. If you are new to the channel, now real quick, let's say that Herman Moore, no Olivier Vernon, you want to buy that? You want to find that Olivier Vernon to trade? Well, he's an elite. He is a right end. So here we go. He is a New York Football Giant. So let's go to the Giants. And I'm going the wrong way because I'm an idiot. I don't know the alphabet. There we go. He's a 92. Uh, program. He is a motivator. And wherever those are. It's randomly thrown in here. Nope, Chem Master. Motivator. <coughs> and we're going to search. Now, I'm not sure if there's any extra. There is one up. That's not mine. Um, So it will say time remaining. You can figure out, do the math, figure out, okay, that's at 8, 15 Eastern Standard Time. But easier way, team wanted, we'll say Chicago Bears or Bears or Chicago or something like that. So that's how you can find it. I'm not going to be accepting trade uh, friend requests, guys. I had like 370 of you guys on my friends list. However, what happened was whenever I play head to head, it would just I'd get a blue screen of death if the other person rage quit, which is really frustrating. Not going to lie. So I unfortunately I cannot accept friend requests um in regards to that. So, but so <coughs> again, here are the offers if you want to offer uh here are the cards if you want to offer on them. Real offers, anything within 10% of a card because that's what EA tax. So Herman Moore goes for roughly 300k. If you offer me something that goes 270k or more, I'll consider it. Now, there's certain positions I don't need, and I'm going to show you guys that right now. So let's go look at my team and tell you what I will not accept because I don't need it. No matter what, you could offer me something that goes for 10 times the value. I'm just not going to accept it. There's no point. I don't need a quarterback. I got Super Bowl MVP Tom Brady. I am all set. I don't need a fullback. Use check. I can't sell. Um, right tackle, I probably will not. I mean, unless there's someone I'm forgetting, he matches mobile blocker times two and the Tennessee times two and secure blocker. He matches great with a use check. Greg Olson, I really, really like. I don't know if there's a tight end I want more. So it's unlikely I'm going to move uh, off Greg Olson. Anything else, though? Running back, wide receiver, any offensive lineman, maybe not left tackle because I'm using that Super Bowl chemistry, but things can change. I might get that Julio Jones, and I don't need that Super Bowl chemistry at left tackle. But so on offense, really just tight end, quarterback, fullback, I really don't need. Maybe right tackle. On defense, I do not need any middle linebacker. I got Brewski. I got Hightower. Big Pats fan. Sorry, sue me. <laughs> uh, Willie McGinnis, right outside linebacker. I love him. But if you can see, edge setter, edge blitzer, field general, tackle machine, field general, those are players I'm keeping. Hence, I'm going to need those chemistries. I got Malcolm Butler, I got Deion Sanders, and I got Malcolm Jenkins. I don't think I need another corner. If you are going to offer me a corner, it's going to have to have locked down a pick specialist where I basically end up, I think he's better than Malcolm Jenkins, and I'd sell Malcolm Jenkins. Other than that, I'm just not going to accept a corner. I And my number four is Mel Blunt. I really like my corners. Um, D-tackle, Quan Shore, I can't sell. So, But you see that Carolina times two. You see that line pusher times two. So, I mean, I and I have line pusher here. If there's an end, one of the ends that has line pusher, that's going to sway me to max that out. 
It's going to help out Quan Short. Now, I am playing like a 3-4, so keep that in mind. Um, both safeties, though, I could look. Left outside linebacker, I could look. So there are definitely a bunch of positions. There's just some I don't need. Now, on offense, but chemistries I can kind of fool around with and find a chemistry that I really like. But it's mostly on defense, like edge setter, edge blitzer, field journal, tackle machine. And then if you're going to offer me a corner, it has to be pick specialist and lockdown. Um, because those are just, I really like those chemistries. But as you can see, people are already offering up on these. I already got an offer on that Herman Moore. I'm not going to look at it. I'm not going to look at these offers till tomorrow. And I'm going to go through them live. You get my live reaction when you see this. But I think I covered everything. Like I said, anything within 10%, guys, just to cover the EA tax. So if I don't like the card, I'm not getting killed. You know, like you may offer me a card that goes for 200k that I really want for Herman Moore, but if I end up not liking him and then I want to sell him, well, I lost 100,000 coins. You know what I mean? And for the Olivier Vernon, you're going to have to wow me on this. I really don't want to get rid of him. You guys or Borderline begged me to put him up. You're going to have to wow me to get rid of him. So if you guys are going to be kind of upset if I don't accept a trade, that's why. I'm just telling you guys I love that card. But we'll see. We will see. Like I said, go check out that Eli Manning poll. I thought it was a good reaction. You also get a face cam. So if you want to see what my ugly mug looks like, you got it right there. Uh, sub if you're new. Uh, offer up, guys. These are always fun. You guys love them. I love them too. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Take it easy. Peace.